Alright, back again. Today we got out the old N64, and I figured we could put in this game here. Star Soldier Vanishing Earth. So, let's pop this in and play some of that. Now, uh, if you're a big shooter fan and you somehow haven't had a chance to play this one, this is a fantastic game, and uh, being on the N64 looks really, really nice. They did a really well, uh, uh, really good job with uh, designing this game here. So there's your intro there. A little bit uh, of a long intro, but uh, not bad by any means. Uh, at the beginning here, you can choose many different uh, things. You can just decide to do a two-minute play or five-minute play. You also go into the options mode here. You can change some of the configurations. Now, when you first start this game up, the difficulty will be on regular, uh, which is pretty brutal. And uh, you can change that to beginner or master. But uh, you can also type in a password to the last stage that you left off on. Uh, it also gives you an option here at the beginning to uh, choose a mission. So what we'll do is we'll just go through here for normal mode and give it a try there. And initially you have three ships that you can choose from. You can see that the different uh, powers that they have for roll and move. Uh, I prefer the, uh, the red ship here myself. And um, interesting enough, you use the D-pad. So we use the D-pad here, use buttons uh, B and A, left and right uh, bumpers here, but uh, your main uh, fire button is going to be uh, just the uh, A button and you do get multi bonuses for uh, continuing to hit other ships, so kind of like chain bonuses. You can see the number in the upper left-hand corner going up. As soon as you uh, stop hitting enemies, though, that will change. And uh, it'll give you a bonus based on, uh, yeah, you can see right there, on how many enemies that you hit. Now, de depending on the difficulty, this game can be extremely brutal. Um, but it has beautiful graphics to it, really cool scrolling 3D effects, and uh, the music is nice. Uh, by clicking the right shoulder, you can uh, do a barrel roll, which will actually deflect some shots. And by pressing the, uh, the left bumper here, you'll wind up using your EX weapon, which I'm not going to use right now. I'll save that for later on when we get up to the boss. Uh, you also have uh, bombs, which are used with the B button. But just a fantastic game. Very, very well designed. different weapon power-ups here that you can pick up along the way, but just really mesmerizing uh, kind of graphics here. Very nice 3D deep look to it. And we're coming up here on our first boss. Sicilian, you are a foolish 
But like I said, by uh, clicking the right bumper here, you can uh, deflect some shots. Other shots you have to be very careful of. And by pressing the uh, button, the left bumper that you can see right there, that one actually uh, shoots out the EX weapon. Here's the end of the first one. Not the best for gameplay here by any means, but you get different uh, bonuses as you can see here for rolling, for saving your uh, your arms, etc. Try and skip out of this. Just a really cool, really beautiful looking uh, shooter. And on the N64, it really does, I think, push the N64 and use a lot of the N64's power. It's a very fun game to get into, and once you, once you start playing it, it's really hard to give up. I mean, even if you do start dying quite a bit, uh, you really just don't want to give up on the game. You really want to keep trying and playing it over and over again to see how good you can get, how far you can get in the game. But just over, overall, just an amazingly well-designed game for the N64. And probably the camera won't do it justice. Uh, it looks so much better in person. Just really puts you in the uh, in the game. Really puts you in the 3D when seeing it in person. I believe this setting that it's on right now is not super difficult, so here's our next boss. I'm trying to stand up here as close to the TV as I can so you guys can kind of hear me over the music. <laughs> Well, I'll give it a, a little bit more of a try here. And uh, maybe till the next stage. Three. Invaded. 
but a definitely worthwhile game to pick up. It's really nice when you can find a game with really good graphics and uh, you know a really good soundtrack that really puts you into the game. And this is one that actually has both of those going for it. The gameplay is really smooth as well. You know, it doesn't feel stiff for uh, controls or anything like that. It actually really plays very smoothly. Really well thought up game. our next boss here but uh, if you put this on uh, expert uh, it really does get challenging the amount of bullets on screen are pretty intense And there we go. Well, just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a look at uh, what Star Soldier Vanishing Earth looked like here for the N64. And uh, I definitely recommend picking this up for your collection if you don't have it in your collection already. It is a uh, fantastic game. It's a lot of fun. Beautiful graphics. Really well designed. And uh, great music as well. But that's about all for me for right now. Like always, I'll put up another video here soon. So thanks for watching.
Mission clear. Mission 5. Terrible. <laughs>